Hey, Elliot here from Bow River Trout Fitters. And if you know me, you know how much I love to fish two-handed rods for steelhead. But being that I don't live on the coast and I can't steelhead every day, I can come down to the bow and use a trout spay and enjoy a really great fight on a really light rod. So the previous generation micro spay has been around, oh, eight or nine years. And now with the advent of the Air 2 rods, Winston have gone ahead and redesigned their micro spays to fall under that Air 2 category. And these new rods are light as air, literally, and absolutely exquisite. Now previously with the Boron 3TH micro spays, they had three, four, and five weight tapers. Now with the new Microspay Air 2s, they've actually added a two weight and removed the five, so we're extremely light in terms of the rods. And uh, I have here in my hand, one thing that they've never had before is the two weight, 10 foot, nine inch. And um, I never thought I would fish such a light rod, but it's incredible. Two weight, you know, a Skagit for this rod. Right now I'm fishing a 210 grain Airflow Skagit Scout. And to put it in perspective, my previous generation four weight threw uh, 300 or even th over 300 grains. So this is extremely light. So Skagit in and around 200 grains, give or take about 25, 30 grains on either side. And then if you're gonna throw a Scandi type head on this, uh, about 180 grains, you know, that's for uh, a Scandi short or a Rage type head. Now, one thing you have to keep in mind when you're fly fishing in general, uh, and that holds for two-handed rods as well, is the upper size of fly that you can throw uh, or cast on any particular line weight. Now, being that this throws a 210 grain Skagit, I'm throwing, you know, pretty decent sized leeches and, and smaller buggers with it. Rod has no problem casting flies, you know, decent sized leeches up to size six and eight, smaller buggers. But what I really wanted this rod for was to swing soft hackles and back swimmers and uh, to skate dries like large stone flies and uh, caddis pupa and so forth. For that type of work and those type of flies, this rod is, a, is absolutely brilliant. So as opposed to the previous generation micro spay, and because these rods require such a light touch, they've gone ahead and slimmed down and narrowed the profile of the upper grip while at the same time lengthening the lower grip a little bit. Now what that's going to do is enable you to generate a lot of line speed using a very compact underhand stroke. And then of course, what I really love about these new rods as opposed to previously with anodized reel seats, they've gone with this beautiful maple burl reel seat and nickel silver hardware. Now what you might notice from me casting this rod is that it flexes very, very deeply. And you might think, well, you know, this is not a very uh, powerful rod or is kind of noodly, but that couldn't be further from the truth. This new S2000 graphite, it goes from bent to straight very fast. That's the nature of the rod, but Winston designed these rods to flex deeper into the butt section, not only for the cast, but for when you're enjoying the fight of a fish as well. So I've been fishing my previous generation Winston Micro Spay 11 foot four weight for eight or nine years now, and it is amazing. But those smaller fish that you catch with it sometimes don't put the kind of bend in it that you're looking for. So you end up looking for, say, those 20 plus inch fish. With this little two weight, every fish in the river is a riot. Being a two weight, it is quite a supple rod. And what it will do is protect those lighter tippets that you will be fishing on those smaller flies. But when it comes to hooking a big fish, it's still a boron butt section in this rod, and I can really pull on those big fish as hard as I have to to either land them or straighten out the hook. Now, if you find yourself in the market for a premium trout spay, micro spay, whatever you want to call them, the Micro Spay Air 2 from Winston has got you covered across the two, three, and four weights. The three and four weight will be the more versatile rods overall because you can throw, of course, bigger flies on them. But if you want to maximize the fun factor and you're prepared to fish smaller flies, this two weight is out of this world. As always, thanks for joining us. Please subscribe to the channel. Leave your comments below. We're more than happy to answer any questions you might have about this or anything else that we do at the shop. And check out the new gear, Winston Microspay Air 2 at bowrivertrailfighters.com.